Our lands sustain us. They filter the water we drink and help clean the air we breathe. They feed us, shelter us, inspire us, and protect us from the effects of a changing climate. They are home to countless species, each crucial to the balance of our natural world. But that balance is tipping. The wild is disappearing, and with it, we are losing the chance to live on a healthy planet. But there is hope. The Nature Conservancy started in 1951 with a humble but profound idea that private citizens could protect more of the nature that people and wildlife depend on. But what we have now become is so much more than that. Protection is no longer enough for conservation. You actually need to return the diversity and abundance to some of these landscapes. I'm Rod Kelsey and I'm the director of the land program for the Nature Conservancy here in California. We are in the midst of a biodiversity crisis. Animals and plants are disappearing at a rate that is extremely alarming. And why should we care about that? Well, the fate of biodiversity is really going to be our fate because science shows us that it's the diversity and abundance of nature that actually makes it resilient and actually makes us more resilient to climate and climate change. The strategy of the land program is to protect, connect, and rewild. We need to protect a much larger, more vast landscape of, of lands dedicated to nature. We need to make sure that they're connected to each other so that animals can move in response to their needs for food and water, but also now in order to respond effectively to climate change. And we need to rewild some of these landscapes. And that's because after 200 years of change, these landscapes actually need to be repaired. We have 640,000 acres of lands that we have some responsibility for, and that includes 13 preserves across the state. And they cover all kinds of different parts of California, from desert to coastal areas to river forests, like the one I'm sitting in here. And that creates an incredible platform for us to use these as living laboratories and to develop common sense, practical, scalable solutions to some of our biggest challenges. TNC California is uniquely positioned to make a difference here. We have one of the most talented team of scientists in the world, so we work across the state and across the nation for that matter in crafting solutions with partners, whether those are public partners, farmers, ranchers, industry, to accelerate the pace of conservation. What we need is a, a place where we've got the, the freedom and the ability to bring the science, to understand how these systems work, to implement the kind of restoration and management work that we need to figure out. And so these living laboratories are where we begin to repair these systems. And so we're able to run experiments. And that kind of discovery not only teaches us about nature itself, but it also teaches us about how to create the solutions. The land program is about protecting nature, but it's also about helping people. And so it's an educational platform. It's public access to nature, which there's too little of. And many of our legacy projects that we originally did have now become public parks. In addition to that, even if you don't go visit those places, 
the clean air and the clean water that you drink and breathe comes from these places. When we succeed, California is going to have one of the largest, most wild networks of connected, protected lands in the country. And what that's going to mean for California is that not only have we secured the future of California's natural diversity, but it is actually thriving in a way that we never knew possible. And that takes careful management. And here at the Nature Conservancy in California, our largest team is dedicated to that mission of stewarding these places for future generations to make sure they indeed remain the strongholds for nature they need to be, not just now, not just in a decade, but a hundred years from now. The land's future is our future. When we protect our lands, we protect ourselves.